Nais ko maging bahagi ng isang adhikain At mag-iisa sa gawaing makajos at masaya Paglilingkod sa Diyos at kapwa Sa ikalawang parokya ng Pasay Kaisa ng Birheng Maria Our Lady of Soros Naranang Viva Pater Dolorosa Virgo de la Pieta Viva Pater Dolorosa De la Pieta Ora pro nobis Sa OLS Ituloy ang saya Pan at pandemya, pagpapalat niya ay makakamtan kapit lang sa Dios ng lubusan. Viva Mater Dolorosa, Virgo de la Pieta, Viva Mater Dolorosa, de la Pieta, ora pro nobis sa Our Lady of Sorrow si tuloy ang saya. Salamat po, O Diyos, Ama, sa pagpapala mong lubos. Sa krus ni Kristo Jesus na iyong anak kami tinubos. Sa patubay ng Espiritu Banal sa aming buhay. At kain ng Maria, ang bagong Eva na Please all stand for the Angelus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, 
that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your Amen. grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning. Let us include in our prayers the intentions of Dominador Guzman Sr., Nancy Tan and family, Peruel de la Peña, Santusildes, Allegri families, Marisa Aboitis, Feli Kiambao and Kiambao Security, Rosita Dizon, Melba Marbella, Father Resti de la Peña SSP, Father Ramon Manalo SSP, Father Arthur Palisada SSP, Patrice Ann Sese, Letlet Salcedo, SuperServe Corporation, Mr. and Mrs. Eduardo Okodaira, Louis and Lourdes Clem, Attorney Evangeline Liamas and Family, Magdalena Clava Ivaldez, Princess Ivaldez Chua, Chua Family, Paz and Family, Jello and Elaine, Paolo, Marlo, Orlando, Arthur and Rose Ann, Ramon Alberto, Rodolfo, Roland and Rosalia Mariano and Kids, Ray Angeline Mariano, Alexander Arroyo, Ngo Ang Si, Ging Flora, Nadine Paula Sese, Francis Kate Paula Sese, Francis Niel Sese, Antonio Nang, all November birthday celebrants of FAC group of companies, all unborn children, all the sick, all healthcare workers, all persecuted Christians, and for the birthday thanksgiving of Cleric Russell Patulot SSP. And for the eternal repose for the soul of the following, Carmelita Guzman, Lutgardo and Erlinda, Angelico and Estilita, Alfonso and Blandina, Gregorio, Raul Jr. and Corazon, Medina Tapang, Ricardo Jr., Ricardo Sr., Rosalina Marquez, Feliciano Marquez Sr., Jose Chan, Cho Yuk Shu, Father Mani Ismael, Hoi Sao Ming, Justin Daniel Bataclan, Rimiel Connell, Father Joseph Butlig SCJ, Artemio Salamat, Marcelita Salamat, Amado Sarmiento Sr., Father Joven Lagdamin SSP, Gilberto Liama Sr., Milagros Liamas, Lourdes Cruz, Bartola Liamas, Celia Santos, Conrad Angeling Orofino, Luningning Canseco, Rosemary Villegas, Anthony Dolier, Marie Michiko Yuda, Marilita Laguda, Telma Dison, Rosby Martinez, Edna Flora and Winston Flora, Maximina Adamus, Sigondo Balisnomo, Rosario Balisnomo, Marcelino Cesbrenio, Lourdes Lakdao, Isabelita Cesbrenio, Virginia Martinez, Marcelo Sabaten, Elma Sabaten, Ibencio Cabell Jr., Loreto Pasqua, Baby Cabell, Salvador Castilla, Camila Castilla, Teofilo Balisnomo, Kining Balisnomo, Catalino Lodet, Severo Cesbrenio, Tinay Manalaysay, Ofelia Batuon, Cynthia Balisnomo, Heidi Alfonso, Steven Sabaten, Conchita Duerme, Guillermo Cabell, 
Gaspar Tubalado, Pedro Cabel, Santos Balunsay, Mariquita Balunsay, Jose Balunsay, Camilo Adamos Balisnomo, Maria Aguas Balisnomo, Jose Aguas Balisnomo, Jose Balisnomo Jr., Nena Balisnomo, Heidi Balisnomo, Nelly Justiniani, Eva Balisnomo, Constantine Sabaten, Francisco Tibangin, Bonifacio Duerme, Antonia Tubalado, Frederick Pasqua, Norma Rimpilio, Rodolfo Rimpilio, Most Reverend Enrique Macaray, Didi, Rogelio, Pablo, Antonio, Boy, Dani, Alejandrino, Pacifico, Francis, Milagros, Gloria, Pilar, Rose, Lutgardo, Jesus and Remy Zabala, Orling and Chit Zabala, Honorio and Rosie Zabala, Benedict Zabala, Rio Zabala, Alan Zabala, Felipe and Emilia Aldana, Christine Aldana, Thelma Dison, Merilita Zabala, Teddy Zabala, Rosby Martinez, Carlitos Oy, Noli, Marisa, Danny, Boy, Anthony, Grace, Zafi Ledesma, Jose and Leoncia Cafe, Emmanuel and Roberta Gumaroy, Juan Gumaroy, Pastor Anil Elpides, Pablo Globio, Jose Globio, Silvestra Globio, Leovigildo and Tito Bagas, Florencio and Winifreda Cafe, Lino and Norma Gumato, Agustin Simbilio, Emmanuel and Primitivo Carpeso, Erlinda Gumaroy, all deceased relatives and friends of the Soriro family, Jose Morales, Sara Morales, Reynalda Soltis, Jesus Puli, Loreto Gonzalez, Charlito Mamon, Pedro Cruz Jr., Benjamin Avancenia, Helda Ledesma, Agri de las Alas, Filomena Cabel, Francisco de las Alas, Antonio Cabel, Macario Crescenciana, Jacinto, Pascuala, Potinciano, Isidoro, Premo Cipriano, Soul of all unborn children, for the lost, forgotten, and abandoned souls in purgatory, all who died of COVID-19, all who died from calamities, all who died from tragedies, and all souls in purgatory. Magandang umaga po mga kasambuhay, mga kaparokya. Ialay po natin mula sa main altar ng Our Lady of Zoros Parish, Pasay City, ang Santa Misa. Para sa iba't ibang intentions ng mga parokyano, deboto at benefactors ng Our Lady of Zoros. Ang Misa ay iaalay ng mga pari ng Society of St. Paul na naka-assign sa parokya. Sa oras na ito, ang mas presider ay si Reverend Father Resti de la Peña SSP. Tayo po ay tumayo, makiisa at ibigay ang sandaling ito kay Jesus sa banal na Eucharistia. Entrance Antiphone The Lord established for him a covenant of peace and made him the prince that he might have the dignity of the priesthood forever.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Good morning, my dear brothers and sisters. Good morning, Father. Today we celebrate the memorial of St. Leo the Great, Pope and Doctor of the Church. And to prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries, let us now call to mind our sins. I confess to so Almighty God, God and, and to you, my brothers, brothers and sisters, sisters that, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, Ever-Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, who never allow the gates of hell to prevail against your church, firmly founded on the apostolic rock, grant her, we pray, that through the intercession of Pope St. Leo, she may stand firm in your truth and know the protection of lasting peace. Through Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. I myself am convinced about you, my brothers and sisters, that you yourselves are full of goodness, filled with all knowledge and able to admonish one another. But I have written to you rather boldly in some respects to remind you, because of the grace given me by God, to be a minister of Christ Jesus to the Gentiles in performing the priestly service of the gospel of God, so that the offering up of the Gentiles may be acceptable, sanctified by the Holy Spirit. In Christ Jesus, then, I have reason to boast in what pertains to God. For I will not dare to speak of anything except what Christ has accomplished through me, to lead the Gentiles to obedience by word and deed, by the power of signs and wonders, by the power of the Spirit of God, so that from Jerusalem all the way around to Avricom, I have finished preaching the gospel of Christ. Thus I aspire to proclaim the gospel not where Christ has already been named, so that I do not build on another's foundation, but as it is written, those who have never been told of him shall see, and those who have never heard of him shall understand. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord has revealed to the nations His saving power. The Lord has revealed to the nations His saving power. Sing to the Lord a new song, for He has done wondrous deeds. His right hand has won victory for Him, His holy arm. The Lord has revealed to the nations His saving power. The Lord has made His salvation known. In the sight of the nations, he has revealed his justice. He has remembered his kindness and his faithfulness toward the house of Israel. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Sing joyfully to the Lord all ye lands. Break into song, sing praise. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. Alleluia, alleluia. 
Whoever keeps the word of Christ, the love of God is truly perfected in him. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A proclamation of the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, A rich man had a steward who was reported to him for squandering his property. He summoned him and said, What is this I hear about you? Prepare a full account of your stewardship, because you can no longer be my steward. The steward said to himself, What shall I do now that my master is taking the position of steward away from me. I am not strong enough to dig, and I am ashamed to beg. I know what I shall do, so that when I am removed from the stewardship, they may welcome me into their homes. He called in his master's debtors one by one. To the first he said, How much do you owe my master? He replied, 100 measures of olive oil. He said to him, here is your promissory note. Sit down and quickly write one for 50. Then to another he said, and you, how much do you owe? He replied, 100 measures of wheat. He said to him, here is your promissory note. Write one for 80. And the master commanded that dishonest steward for acting prudently. For the children of this world are more prudent in dealing with their own generation than the children of light. Brothers and sisters, the gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. <coughs> Magandang umaga po mga kapatid sa ating pagbasa ngayon sa ating ebanghelyo ay narinig naman muli natin ang ang uh, talinhaga ng Panginoon tungkol sa isang katiwala na sabi nga ay madiskarte madiskarte sa pamamaraan sapagkat ayun nga sa ating talinhaga ay na siya'y nagipit, binigyan ng uh, uh, panahon, napakabait ng kanyang amo, no? na bagamat uh, binalitaan na itong katiwalang ito ay hindi nakatiwala, o pagkakatiwalaan, ay binigyan pa siya ng sapat na panahon para gumawa ng paraan. Not necessarily, no, na Uh, para ayusin no siguro para para gumawa ng paraan na to save face no na huwag siya mailagay sa alanganin pero ini ang iniisip niya kung titingnan natin na maigi sa talinhaga ay eh tila paghahanda na kung anong meron sa bandang huli parang may katiyakan na aalisin na sa kanya ang panunungkulang bilang katiwala ng kanyang amo. Ililigtas ang kanyang sarili sa paraan na bagamat maaaring ikalugi niya dahil nga kung titignan natin sa Ebanghelyo rin, paano, niya, paano siya gumawa ng paraan? Kinaltasan niya ang kanyang sanay kakabigin sa anumang transaksyon na meron siya. Gayunpaman ay sinikap niya dahil sa paniniwalang siguro sa bandang huli ay ang mga binigyan ko ng pabor ay sila ring ay sila ring, sila ring tatanggap sa akin no ay ako ay i-adapt nila no probably they might hire me also despite of me now about to lose my job 
Alam niyo, mga kapatid, <clears throat> habang pinagninilayan, pinagninilayan natin ang, ang uh, ibanghilong ito, tila masasabi natin, hindi malayo, hindi nalalayo ang pag-iisip natin sa pag-iisip ng Panginoon. What do I mean by that? Tila parang sinasabi ng Panginoon, ang pamamaraan nga ng mundo ay tila kakaiba sa pamamaraan ng langit. Pero sa bagay na ito, parang nakalalamang ang pamamaraan ng mundo. Bakit? Kasi para sa mga umiiral sa buhay ng mundo, time is so limited. Maiksi lang ang panahon mo. Maiksi lang ang ibubuhay mo. Sandali lang ang inilaan na panahon para sa iyo. Hindi yan pang habang buhay. Kung kaya't habang ikaw ay naririyan at buhay pa, gawin mo nang nararapat mong gawin para ikaw ay makinabang ng mahusay. Sapagkat ang, pinag, ang iniisip ng isang makamundong tao ay tunay na kahit pa paano sa maiksing panahong ito, ay makikinabang ako ng higit. Gayun din, tila sinasabi ng Panginoon, sana may ganito ring pag-iisip ang isang taong makalangit. One who sees things not as temporary material or wealth that can only sustain you in a small time, but rather to see things as God would like us to see, really as a moment, as for the lifetime, as for a lifetime, panghabang buhay, long term, ika nga. Probably this is one good way to look into ourselves, how we look things as we move about in life habang tayo'y umaharap sa mga pagsubok sa mundo, hindi lang sa isang pansamantalang pananaw, kundi ano ba at saan ba ako ihahatid ang lahat ng mga ginagawa at pagpapasya ko sa buhay. Minsan, napapahanga tayo sa mga <coughs> tao na kapag gumagawa ng mga plano sa kanilang mga negosyo, kung ano man na meron sila, ay tila nakikita nila kung saan patungo ang kanilang pinagsisikapan o pinaglalaanan ng panahon. Tila sukat na nila, alam na nila, ito ang kikitain ko, itong makakabig ko, ito probably, ito yung medyo mawawala sa akin sa simula, pero bandang huli ay alam ko, makikinabang ako ng malaki. Siguro sa ganong pag-iisip, kapag naririnig natin mga ganitong tao, kwentado na lahat, alam na lahat ang gagawin. <clears throat> The more also that we should also begin to see how we look at life as really an investment coming from God. How would you use this? How would you utilize this? How would you utilize this for your own advantage? Probably with some selfish motive. We do at the start, hmm, puro kabig lang sa akin. Puro sa akin lang. Ako lang makikinabang. Pero bandang uli, you also have to look at the end of this on, where am I going? Where am I leading to? Recently, I was invited for a house for a office office blessing no <clears throat> karamihan sa mga nandoon sa opisina ay no may mga katungkulan ang iba sa kanila ay na, nanalo sa uh, sa election hindi lang barangay no? sa mga nakalipas na election so may mga pananagutan talaga no may pananagutan sa kanilang constituents, may pananagutan sa kanilang mga negosyo. 
at sa kanilang yun nga sa kanilang uh, opisina. Ako ay natutuwas dahil sa sa kanilang pag-uusap tila they give also their own experiences sharing each other's experiences. Sinasabi nila, ganito ginawa ko no? para <clears throat> makasigurong mananalo ako o ganito ang ginawa ko para sigurado na bandang huli no? ay hindi lang ako ang makikinabang kundi yung marami sa aking mga kababayan. No? Sawa na just no? I hope na lahat ng ibinabahagi nila ay uh, talagang uh, tao sa kanilang puso na nais nilang makapagsilbi. Pero of course, alam naman nila yung hamon no, ng pagsisilbi para sa bayan at yung mga pananagutan nila sa kanilang mga sa mga taong nakapaligid sa kanila. Pero what is so no, so inspiring no? at talaga namang hahangaan mo sila is how they plan their courses of action. No? Ito ang plano ko after a few years, pagkalipas ng mga panahon, ganito na sana ang mararating. Hindi lang kanyang sarili, no? kundi mararating mismo ng kanyang, ng kanyang uh, bayan, ng kanyang katungkulan. How I wish na that we also have such attitude as the gospel would try to challenge us. In the closing words of our Lord from the gospel reading today, indeed, it is a challenge for Jesus to tell us, for the children of this world are more prudent in dealing with their own generation than the children of light. And so, dear brothers and sisters, challenging us once more, Maraming ipinagkatiwala sa iyo. Maraming gustong makita totoo ang Panginoon na sa pagtitiwala niya sa iyo ay magbubunga, magdudulot ito ng maraming kabutihan. Hindi lang para sa iyo, kundi para sa mas nakararami. Lahat ay biyaya. Lahat ay ipinagkatiwala. Kung kaya hindi dapat nasasayang, hindi dapat pinababayaan, kundi pinalalago, at sa bandang huli, ang pagpapalago na ito ay, mag, ay mag, magdudulot ng maganda at mabuti para sa atin at para sa iba. Sa pagpapatuloy ng misa, nawa ang pagagabay ng Espiritu sa ating pamumuhay ay magdulot sa atin ng mas mabunga at mas maiging pakikitungo sa kapwa at sa ating Diyos. Amen. Prayers of the Faithful. Eternal Father, on this Friday, we honor the Sacred Heart of your only begotten Son, Jesus. On the first Good Friday, he gave his life for us, his blood, his wounds, his scourges, the thorns, the cross, the bowed head, tell us. No one loves more than he who gives his life for the loved one. With confidence, we now pray, through the heart of Jesus, hear us. Through the heart of Jesus, hear us. In Jesus, you gave the gift of the gospel of eternal life. Come to the aid of the universal church, that she may always preach and preserve the gospel. Make all humanity conform its life, laws, morals, and teachings to the gospel values, we ask. Through the heart of Jesus, hear us. In Jesus, you gave us the gift of the Eucharist, our daily bread. May all Catholics have true devotion to the Holy Communion and Eucharistic adoration. May we live every day in faith and with passion for service and self-giving. We ask. Through the heart, Through the heart of, of Jesus, Jesus, hear yes. us. In Jesus, you bless us with the gift of the Church and the priesthood. 
May the Church be faithful in her mission to gather your flock. May the Pope, bishops, and priests, formed according to the heart of Jesus, be untiring laborers of your harvest, we ask. Through the, the heart, heart of Jesus, Jesus hear us. In Jesus, you called persons to the gift of religious consecration with the evangelical vows for various apostolates. Continue to multiply vibrant relig religious vocations, especially among the youth, we ask. Through the heart, the heart of, of Jesus, Jesus, hear us. In Jesus, you call us to be salt and light of the world. Enable everyone in the family, at school, in the workplace, and in government to follow human and spiritual values so that faith, hope, and charity may blossom, we ask. Through the, the heart, heart of, of Jesus, Jesus, hear us. For our personal and community intentions. We ask, through the heart, the heart of, Jesus, of Jesus, hear us. Father, mercy, we, your favored children, lift our hearts and minds to you through the sacred heart of Jesus. Embrace us with your mercy and let us be channels of your compassion through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness you have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and the work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Bless are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine in the work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Lord God, we ask you to receive us with the peace of the sacrifice we offer you with humble and contrite hearts. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Through the offerings made here, we pray, O Lord, graciously shed light on your church so that your flock may everywhere prosper and that under your governance, the shepherds may become pleasing to your name. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord the Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord, for us in the festival of Saint Leo, you bid your church rejoice. So too, you strengthen her by the example of his holy life, teach her by his words of preaching, and keep her safe in answer to his prayers. And so with the company of angels and saints, we sing the hymn of your praise as without end we acclaim. Holy, 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 holy Lord, Lord God, God of hosts, heaven, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna, Hosanna in, in the highest. highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the you are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gives you pray, by sending down your spirit upon them, like the Jew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. 
At that time, he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is a chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Save us, Savior of the world, for by your cross, by the cross and resurrection, and resurrection you have set, set us free. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church is spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, with Jose, our Cardinal Archbishop, with all bishops and with all the clergy. We lift up to you today the thanksgivings of Janine Gonzalez and Pedi Bautista as they celebrate their birthdays. And we ask that you could sustain, O Father, in your healing love, Freddy Gamboa, Celi Bernabe, Rory Alinea Martin, Willie and Brenda Reyes, Silvia Berenguer, Lu Peña Serada Ang, Bubut Nugid, Aimi Magpok Ro, Kai Ki Chit and Robic and Kino Kalikdan, Papa and Matet, LinkedIn, Jonathan Hernandez, Tesla Badan, Charina Nidwasa, Rowena and Charles Eriga, Jess Figueroa, Ed Adonis, Michael Heneta, MJ Mangawil, Atina Marie Montes, Esmelita Salcedo and Perla Saldajeno, Maximino De Sena, Rene Portillo, Jack Sales, Julio Carlos Rojas Lara, Baby Rojas and Dong and Joy Lara, Audi Quintana, Reggie Reyes, Faustino Diaz, Arlette Mendoza, Nancy T, and Mariflor Ebio. Remember your servants, O Lord, especially the deceased members of Our Lady of Sorrows Parish, the deceased members of the St. Paul Mass Association, the deceased members of the Pauline family, whom you have called from this world to yourself, Grant that they who are united with your Son in a death like his may also be one with him in his resurrection. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, especially the deceased, deceased members of the Oblates of the Holy Spirit sisters, Anita Aban, Carmelita Galdones Guzman, Ricardo Guzman Sr., Anthony Uson, Manuel Recto, Jorge Landoy, Gloria Landoy, Rimos Landoy, Remigio Lenterna, Alan Jasper, Feliciano Marquez Sr., Rosalina Marquez, Erlinda de la Peña, Pedro Magbanua, Elsie Mantaring, Elsie and Corazon Bear, Hipolito Marcelino, Francisco and Epipania Bear, Marlon Bilardo, Roberto Bandola, and Rodolfo Riamilio, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them 
into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, protector of the Universal Church, with Peter, James, and John, and Andrew, and Paul, and all the Blessed Apostles, Blessed James Alberione, Blessed Timothy Giacardo, Blessed Elena Guerra, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may marry to be coerced to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. The Savior's command informed by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Our Father, who art, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed, hallowed be thy, thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come. Thy, thy will, will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give, give us this day our daily bread and forgive, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as, as we forgive, forgive those, those who trespass, trespass against us. And lead, and lead us not into temptation, temptation but deliver, deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Lord, look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you, brothers and sisters. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold, Jesus, our healing and our deliverance, the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I, am I am not, not worthy, worthy that you should, should enter, enter under my roof, but only, only say, say the, the word, word, and my soul shall be healed. The body and blood of Christ bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Communion Antiphone Peter said to Jesus, You are the Christ, the Son of the living God. And Jesus replied, You are Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church. For those who cannot receive the Holy Communion, especially the sick and OFWs, join us in praying the spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself fully to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen.
Let us pray. Be pleased, O Lord, we pray, to govern the church you have nourished by this holy meal, so that firmly directed, she may enjoy ever greater freedom and persevere in integrity of religion. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please all kneel as we pray for the eternal repose of our beloved dead brethren. Together. Lord, my, my Creator, Creator and Redeemer, I believe that in your justice you establish purgatory for those souls who pass into eternity before having totally paid their debts of sin or punishment. I also believe that in your mercy you accept suffrages, particularly the holy sacrifice of the Mass for the relief and liberation. Cheer up my faith and infuse in my heart sentiments of pity toward these dear suffering brothers and sisters. Eternal rest grant to them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. May they rest in peace. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, King of glory, through the intercession of Mary and all the saints, free the souls of the faithful departed from the punishments of purgatory, and through the intercession of Saint Michael, Standard bearer of the heavenly army, guide them to the holy light promised to Abraham and to his descendants. I offer you, Lord, sacrifices and prayers of praise. Accept them for these souls and admit them to eternal joy. Eternal rest grant to them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. May they rest in peace. Amen. Jesus, good master. I plead with you on behalf of the souls toward whom I have a greater debt of gratitude, justice, charity, and family bonds, parents, benefactors, brothers and sisters of the Pauline family and relatives, our departed parishioners and devotees. I recommend to you those who had greater responsibilities on earth, Priests, religious, religious, civil, civil authorities, authorities superiors. superiors. I, I plead with you also for forgotten souls and for those who were more devoted to the Divine Master, to Mary, Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, and to Saint Paul the Apostle. Lord, deign to admit them soon into eternal happiness. Eternal rest grant to them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. May they rest in peace. Amen. Please be seated for a few announcements. Sa buong buwan ng November ay muli natin gugunitain ang ating mga yumao. Ang lahat ng misa sa November ay misa kumon para sa mga yumao. Pakilagay ang mga pangalan ng mga yumaong mahal sa buhay sa mga envelopes na may tatak na misa kumon. Kalakip ang inyong love offerings. Ibigay ang mga envelopes sa parish office. Pwede rin pong ihulog ang misa kumon envelope sa offering box na may cross malapit sa altar. Tuloy-tuloy po ang mga pagpapagawa sa mga facilities ng simbahan. Pwedeng ipadala sa parish office ang inyong mga love offerings, pledges at donations sa ating Dambana Fund at humingi po ng acknowledgement receipt o gamitin ang Metrobank account Our Lady of Soros Parish 2917-2918-22793. Sunday Regular Confession, 8.30 a.m. to 11 a.m., 4.30 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. Para sa mga nais magsakristan, dapat po ay 10 years old pataas at nakapag-first communion na. Kausapin si Brother Nelo o pwede rin iwan ang pangalan at contact number sa parish office. Para sa mga nais maging lectors at commentators, kailangan po ay 16 years old pataas at biyasa sa pagbabasa sa English o Filipino. Pakibigay ang pangalan at contact number sa parish office. Para sa mga nais maging ministers of Holy Communion, 
makipag-ugnayan po sa parish office para sa mga requirements. Pakiiwan ang buong pangalan at contact number. Maraming salamat po. Thoughts from the Founder No gift of God is wasted as much as with the mind, which is the most precious. How many poisoned pastures, especially today, for reading materials, radio, cinema, television. How many thoughts run contrary to faith and virtue? Please all stand. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Together with my brother priest, we'll give the blessing. And may Almighty God protect and bless you always, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass has been offered. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. Mula sa parokya ng Our Lady of Soros, F.B. Harrison, Pasay City, mula sa mga pari ng Society of St. Paul na naka-assign sa parokya, Mula sa Sambuhay TV Unit ng Our Lady of Soros Parish, salamat po. God bless you. Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, care.